is going. So, it is time to go back to Tingle's Balloon Trip of Love for the Nintendo DS, the English patch. And, uh, well, let's get going. We s finished off the third chapter, if memory serves right, a couple days ago. And so, let's get back right into it. Yeah, we just wrote. Yeah, I was. Yeah, I just said chapter, but no, actually, it's more like pages of a book. Just got started on page four, to be more accurate. Hey, kitty. You wanna come on my nap? No? Alright, anyway. The yellow brick road. Yeah, that's, that's where we are. <laughs> he looks scared. What's this thing? Uh, it's a lizard, apparently. <laughs> Is he going to be scared like this at that every little thing? Um, no, you have to double click on it. Well, that accomplished something, at the very least. <coughs> uh -huh. Yeah, there seems to be a path leading there, but no. Or unless it's a path that you can only take, like, going down. It's quite possible. <coughs> <coughs> well, there's a hall where I can send my little friend. Examine. Stuffing its cheeks with something tasty. Uh, straw? Would that work? I give it a shot. <laughs> um, what if I request him? Even if you say please. <laughs> yeah, so basically, you can't do it. Uh, Is that what you have to do? That doesn't sound very nice, but... Gotta try, right? But it kinda looks like I don't have anything to use as ammunition. Doesn't it? Uh, it's hard to tell. Well, there I can request him to go in. Here I go! The way is blocked by something soft. Yeah. <laughs> God, this the squirrel's butt. Like, like maybe because it, it because it keeps stuffing its face like this. Maybe on the inside inside tree trunk, maybe his his body is like huge and taking taking all of the space up there. <laughs> I don't know. Just an idea. Um, a thick stem with leaves and branches. Hmm. Oh, that flower is now closing in. <coughs> the dialogue sequence. <sighs> oh, hey, rupees. Tingle always loves rupees. South house. The faded letters are impossible to read. Mm, if I aim at it with my slingshot, I'm guessing. Yeah, it must make a thing noise. <laughs> but that still doesn't accomplish anything. Is that the same tree? No, I think it's a different one. Ah, something is shining up there. Will you please go in there? Check it out for me. I found something! Ah, rupees.
structural integrity unsecure, unsafe. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Miss, that beep beep you just did. What was that? <laughs> Analysis. Awesome, do it again. <laughs> Material straw, <laughs> malice none, hostility none, content none. Awesome, you can tell all that. <laughs> it would have been more more impressive if she actually could say what is in there, rather than just listing things that are not in there. She's so cool, <coughs> but antipath antipathic. <laughs> I walk on that bridge now. I b I bet you fall down, so I should probably finish exploring first. The cliff is just jutting out at an angle. It's not as far as you thought at first. You are not sure about the exact distance. What? You can shake the trees across ac across the c the across the canyon or uh, or whatever it is. Ooh, shiny eyes! No, wait. Before we send him in, is that n another squirrel? Oh, no, it's that guy again, the guy who sells maps. Which is weird enough, because in Majora's Mask, Tingle makes his own maps. Mm. So it doesn't really make any sense. I've picked this up, picked up the map of the woods. 50 rupees. <coughs> Price is still as steep as ever. Would have expected, well... Given that the rupee counter has five digits, that you would find more rupees in this game, but maybe it's only like later on that you start finding a lot of them, and that more are actually like necessary. Leaves are protecting the trunk like an umbrella. I'm guessing there's nothing in there now that this guy's gone, but. Mm. I thought so. Didn't expect there to be two important things in there. Uh, now it's shining again, but it's rupees. I'm just going to send him in. I found something! It was shining exactly like rupees, so yeah. Just about the same amount as well. Almost looks like yeah. I was gonna say it look, looked like it has a face on it. Look at these things all with a uh, different facial expressions. Wake up! Uh, I guess not. Well, is is it? Going to do anything if I try to bring them down? Uh, wait, what? They dodge? Oh, yeah, they seem to be dodging. Yeah, okay, fair enough. You are not supposed to be doing that. Um, it's snoring so hard. It sounds like it's choking. Choking? Yeah, maybe if I tickle it. Achoo! <laughs> yeah, I thought so. <laughs> thought it had to be something like that. Hello, I'm the human face tree. <laughs> uh, well, let's speak to it. This forest is dangerous. Don't you think? Squirrels are like a gang. Let me see that map. Yes, yes, show it to me. It's going to show me something on it. 
with squirrels den around there are a lot of dangerous squirrels when you go there please be careful yeah but I bet it's dangerous for trees not so much for uh, Tingle himself hmm. but what do I know Aren't they cute, my little children? Oh, is that uh, some kind of mm, Deku tree or something, maybe? They all make a different noise. Yeah, not quite, I guess. It's cl they're, they're all close enough to each other. Targets. I see targets, but they're supposed to be flowers, aren't they? Flowers that look suspiciously like targets. Maybe you do have to do that. Maybe the bees will be making more honey if you open up the flowers for them. Although Looking at them like this, it doesn't seem like there is any pollen for them to, to collect from these flowers once they open up. What about these bushes, like the one on the right? Can I shoot at it? Can I shoot it with my slingshot? Nah, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Water smells a little. Can it run out of straw if you do it too many times? It would be funny. <laughs> Maybe you can die. Did I do well? <laughs> Request him to go in there. He's gonna say, even if you say please. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, it acts like a slide. That robot looks like it must be pretty tough, so maybe it can move that bell because it seems like, looking at the map, it seems like there's something to be found down there to the south. Mm. <laughs> I keep forgetting that I could I could ask for hints as well if if I ever remain like utterly stuck. <laughs> Mister, it's a yellow bridge. If we cross it, we can get to the station. Uh, well, let's try at the very least. <laughs> Investigate far side. Oh. <laughs> Who is that? <coughs> It's not very nice. <laughs> that sounded like Hapona's song at the beginning, but then <laughs> it became, well, n not quite the right song at the end. <laughs> it, it turned into something very different. But it's a funny nod to the Zelda series, anyway. Oh no! The bridge! He cut the bridge! <laughs> Male person, estimated age 25 years. <laughs> Motive for bridge destruction? Unknown. <laughs> and then, and there she goes. Hey, miss! We can't cross. Miss Bariki went away. Mister, what will we do? Mm. 
Yeah, it shows you a cut tree on the other side, so I bet if you could cut that tree, it, it would make a bridge to help you cross. But you need something to allow you to do that. Well, I guess nothing good will come from trying to examine twice the same stuff. Oh. There she goes again. <laughs> you look so scared all the time. Buriki-san! <laughs> the pod crashed. Cause unknown. The street to the city. Cut off by the cloaked man. The street? More like the road, not the street. Reaching the city under these circumstances? Impossible. A different route must be found. That is all. Oh, so this is farewell? Kind of sad. Hey, that's right. If I go to the city, I'll learn manners. If you go to the city, your wishes come true. My auntie said so. <laughs> really? She said so, right, mister? Uh, what auntie? I can't even remember what happened on the previous episode because it's been a couple of days. Yeah, if you watch this on YouTube, w when I archive the stream, yeah, so just so you know. The reason I might not remember what you just watched in the previous episode is because a few a couple of days passed since then. <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go on a limb and say yes. Don't you have anything you wish for, <laughs> miss? Wish? Yeah. <laughs> Something you want to do or become. Anything like that. <laughs> there is something. See? And let's go together. If we go together, we'll make it there somehow. We're companions, <laughs> good friends. Yay, you too, mister. Are they going to do the follow the yellow brick road sound holding hands? <laughs> Come on, mister. Uh, yeah. <laughs> She's not about to let Tingle do. Buriki joined Tingle's party? Question mark. <laughs> Hmm. I bet you could move the bell. Request can now be used. Analysis can now be used. Well, let's save that progress. Good day, I am Pig. Alright. Let's move on. We're still missing the lion. No idea if it's going to be in this page of the book. Well, analyze this. Why not? <laughs> Material, mostly copper. Weight, approximately 100 weights. 100 weights? Yeah, I... <laughs> I, I played the fan translations Captain Rainbow, which, which was much worse. So this seems like really good by comparison, but there are still like a couple things that could be translated better, in my opinion. A hundred weights, or say weight units, if if you like. I mean, it, it gives it a, a, a kind of sci-fi vibe, but at least you understand what it means. But there, just. Come on, mouse. Why is my mouse no, not responding? <laughs> Don't try to make conversation. Okay, well... <laughs> Can you move it? <laughs> Apparently not. How about we analyze that pond? 
Because I haven't really found any kind of useful interaction with this. Oh. Well, here, here comes something. You heard a loud noise from afar. Is it that tree? No, that's not it. Or maybe now the bell is gone. Without any reason or explanation. Analyze this. <laughs> depth of, of water, about one to two depth. <laughs> it's a small bug. And that's all she has to say. Let's keep investigating. I keep going around in circles in this place. But now maybe the bell is gone without any explanation? <sighs> uh. Well, let's go there. <coughs> well, it's still in the way and I can't access that house that seems to be to the west on the map. Maybe if they all push together. No? Yeah, I guess you can't ask them to do that. If it's not the 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 meant method to get past this, then I guess they wouldn't have thought about it. Get that for me, please. I found something. Rupees! I knew it. Fork in the road. What's the name of that forest? Is it supposed to be a Zelda kind of forest, like the Lost Woods? Uh, it almost looks like it. this is the place where I'm supposed to be meeting with all these girls. A secret passage. He said there would be plenty of squirrels around here. A leaflet is on the ground. Pick it up. <laughs> What's it say? A flyer full of, of dubious information, yet somehow eye catching. Want to fall in love? Don't have what it takes? Every look in the mirror makes you sigh? Who can help? Sorry, old you. I can. Come see. Love ya. <laughs> love ya. A rusty empty oil drum. What's this? Uh, just a, a shack. A cork? Might be useful to get with you. We'll have to find a use for this. <laughs> Looks like a poster, but the colors have faded, so you can't really tell what it's about. Uh, that may have not been the best idea. Oh, or maybe it is, yeah. <laughs> There's an old book. Might be useful. Take it with you. Scary book. Old newspaper. An old magazine. That looked more like a wallet to me more than anything else. An old magazine. Uh, but I don't have a key though. Maybe with this. Made a sound. <laughs> and that 
made it, that made him jump. Uh, I use this pole that wasn't holding the shelf up. <laughs> There's funny useless little inter reactions to, to, to you examining them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I'm guessing that's all then. Uh, a rusty empty oil drum. <coughs> Let's go north. <laughs> Oh, it's the same thing. I didn't notice that there was a passage there earlier, though. <sighs> what? The bell moved again. Oh, and now it's c completely in the way. Material and temperature haven't changed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it didn't accomplish anything the first time, there's no reason that it should <laughs> accomplish anything the second time either. I tried. Oh yeah, th th there was a... that squirrel from earlier. Well, I found it by the squirrel, so I thought it might do something, but... <coughs> Use the scary book? Nah, <laughs> that's not what you're supposed to be doing. A cork you found in the rundown shack, it smells faintly of wine. Use the cork. Yeah, but... <laughs> How would that help anything? Mm. Mm. There's one tree that is a different... Oh yeah, but it's the, the tall tree that, that, that I might have to cut down. Because I was gonna say there is one on the map that I hit that is a different color from all the rest. Uh, wait, what? Oh? oh? <laughs> there is definitely something in there. Oh, there's the lion. Yeah, and he seems as a uh, easily scared as he is. Otherwise, hey you, aren't you scared? You guys, look. See how strong I am? Give me all your rupees, and no sudden moves. <laughs> He's so easy to scared of anything, of everything. Don't die, stream, don't die on me. Come on, come back to life. Come on. No sudden move or I'll crush you with this bell. Ah, oh, that's it. Don't try to bargain. Hand over your rupees. <laughs> Analyze this. <laughs> yeah, analyze this. <laughs> Physical strength over 100 force. That's right, with that much power, I don't have to be scared at all. <laughs> the three laws of robotics. One, do not harm humans. He's not a human, he's a lion. Obey the commands. Three, other than that, do what's most convenient. But he's not human! Come on! <laughs> Well, I guess as far as this game is concerned, anything anthropomorphic can't be hurt. More like... Oh yeah, tickle him! 
That makes sense. Here I go. <laughs> Did I do well? Oh, no, that didn't do anything, I guess. That's his default. But what is with this puppet? Don't act so weird. <laughs> Request. I tried. What do you want? Don't get weird on me. <laughs> yeah, I admit it would be weird. Use the scary book. Yeah, to scare him off. What, is he reading? Pretending to be reading the story? Quick, <laughs> joking. That didn't scare me. <laughs> he changed color, though. You can't... You, you can read all you want. I'll be f f f f fine he barely seems fine. But do I just have to wait? Or do I have to make like a different request now? Like this maybe? Like... Who? is not working fine. I don't know why. Maybe I need a mouse map. I'll try again after having selected him, like I just did. No. Uh-uh. <coughs> uh, think, Rudy. Think. Uh, the cork? No. I don't see what that would accomplish. I tried. Uh, let's try tickling him, tickling him again. I think I did pretty well, don't you? Nope. That's not it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that didn't change. <laughs> Heart rate increasing. <laughs> well, we're, we're on the right track at any rate, but what else? What's that? Rupees. Give me rupees. Let's examine him. He's peering out anxiously from under the bell. Or speak with him? Don't try to bargain. Hand over your rupees. Uh, threaten him with a screwdriver. I don't know. What's that? Rupees? Give me rupees. No. Uh, well, that would be pretty scary. Maybe. No. Uh, well, not the map, obviously. That's not very scary. Drawing a blank. Could the little guy go from one tree to the other? Yeah, but it seems like... Where do you think you're going? Move and I'll crush you with this bell. I can't go there. Like, move towards him. I can't. There's always this hint guy who I could ask, but... Or maybe if I use the slingshot on the bell and not on him, it'll make it make a ting noise to make him jump, maybe? Tried yet. Use it again? Not sure you want to use this item. Use the scary book. Uh, 
That seems a bit different from before. Didn't he just change color again? Since I'm fine, you see, there is no need to read anymore at all. <laughs> um, we're gonna have to agree to disagree. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not scared! <laughs> that man's immense strength will be of use. <laughs> we will pursue him. Yeah, I would agree. Hunt for a coward. Okay, moving on. <clears throat> well, there's the bell. Where's the lion? The bell has been cast away. starting to get cold. Not in the game. For real, I mean. Add another layer of clothes. <sighs> okay, there we go. Luck cabin. Didn't I just see something like this before? Saint statue made of stone. There aren't ma any offerings there. Can I offer a cork? Use the cork. But nothing happens. <laughs> There's a hole right there under the house. You go in there. Yay, I get to help Mr. Tingle. Here I go. Is he going to be scared again? Oh? Kakashi vanished into the hall. It's Kakashi. He's inside the house. He's looking at us from the inside. <laughs> well, yeah, it works if he can open it from the inside. Ta-da! How to play with the forest animals. Guns. Everyone's hunting house. <laughs> and then the guns just fire. There's a window. The curtains are closed, so you can't look inside. The window has crude glass in it. Glass. It's too dark to see what it is. There's a candle, but I've got nothing to light it up. Unless... <laughs> All she does is kick, so yeah, I expected maybe because she looks like uh, Ultraman. Judging from her face, that maybe she has a sort of laser beam that will light up the candle, but well... <laughs> Material wax. <laughs> this lighting equipment requires no electricity. Uh, it's really dark in here. Moonlight is entering through the window. Uh, it's too dark to see what it is. Yeah, it's the hall where the scarecrow came from. Guess I'm not doing anything in there until I can get my hands on like matches or uh, or if I. If, if it's possible to open the curtains, maybe I can get some more light inside. No? Well, yeah. That, that was the right solution. There's something inside. A key. A key came out. Da -da 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 -da. Might be useful. Take it with you. The yeah, apron has been discarded. Well, without more light, I expect that I can't do anything else in here, so let's move along. A key. Where would that key fit? Where would it fit? A key. 
Oh yeah, the toolbox. It kind of feels like Monkey Island in in terms of a uh, like presentation of the story. Use the small key. Like it's divided into chapters so that some sections of the game are like self-contained. It makes figuring things out a bit easier. Well, there we go. <laughs> Matches. Could I maybe set fire to die to, to that oil drum? Something maybe to, to consider trying. Not in real life, kids. You don't do that in real life. Uh, Let's see. Matches. <coughs> Stuff dear. Nice handlers. <laughs> I guess I have to keep tr to to keep. Ah, uh, yeah, there's the lion head. You can already kind of make it out in, in the darkness. Uh, shoot. Yay! A rope. A length of rope might be useful. Take it with you. You got a rope. Can I speak to it? Because I think it's just him hiding. Uh, a s stuffed animal. Yeah, analyze this, yeah. <laughs> she would be able to tell if it's uh, alive <laughs> or not. Small beast of liquid detected on surface. <laughs> uh, well, all, all she can do is kick. Unless she has a sort of flying kick. Uh, oh, that didn't do anything. Uh, didn't it just blink? I can't reach that! <laughs> uh, request? No, I can't reach that! Um, or maybe you're not supposed to do anything with it. Uh, or maybe not now, at the very least. Oh, or I could shoot it to try to get it to react. Ouch! <laughs> uh, oh, that, that made something roll. Expired juice came running from somewhere. Drink it? Well, if it's expired... Well, that might m d make for a, a funny scene, so let's try it. <laughs> that was an, emer an emergency. <laughs> yeah, and uh, then that's all. That's all it did. Okay, can I get to keep the empty? Mister is not good to drink stuff from the floor. I thought maybe the, the empty bottle would be useful. Ah, the lion is in there. That looks like his eyes. Oh, a snake. Oh, I just left. Okay. Uh, or was it the eyes of the snake, maybe? Because that looks like that looked similar. There is nothing there. Okay. <clears throat> Fair enough. Oh, 
That was completely by accident. Ah, uh, there he is. Is he going to be in the tall grass? Squirrels. Squirrels. Uh. Oh yeah, there he is. <laughs> Analysis. <laughs> J just, to, just to hear what she has to say more than anything <laughs> else. Temperature somewhat high. <laughs> Stop staring at his butt like this, Tingle. <laughs> uh, straw. <laughs> to kill his butt. Here I go. <laughs> more like poking him in the, <laughs> in the ass more than anything else. It's alive. Yeah, I figured as much. Uh, request. I don't know. It's not going to do. I think soft <laughs> or kick his butt <laughs> I don't know anything goes I'm pretty sure she didn't need to go that hard <laughs> <laughs> task complete uh, finish Yeah, but he's just, he's just a scared lion, so why? Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what is it then? A squirrel? Oh no, that's something else. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that's a squirrel boss. <laughs> Very cartoony. Oh, okay. I thought it might it might end up like miles and miles away. <laughs> that squirrel sure was big. Can I set fire to this empty oil drum? Use the matchbox. Well, that did something. Quickly. Uh, okay, well, uh. The old rack is blowing in the night wind. <laughs> Maybe I should try setting fire to everything I see. Uh, nope, that didn't quite accomplish what I wanted to try. Uh. See if let's try it again. Use the matchbox. No. <laughs> okay. Let's let's try somewhere else. Mm. Can I shoot them, these guys? <laughs> they retaliate. Okay. Uh, let's try the left one. See what it does. The same thing? Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, that's not quite what you're supposed to be doing. Well, there is still the question of that um, that tree that I could knock down, but I don't know how to knock it down. I'm guessing I would need an axe, for one thing. Or maybe the lion. Or maybe I could use the rope on it. Use the rope? No. Um... Yeah, like try to throw the rope at that uh, tree trunk on the other side. No, you can't throw very well. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> Fair enough. <coughs> no, there, there, there's nothing left in there. That tree, I'm still not sure what to do with it. It kind of looks like a Deku tree, but beyond that... Uh, could I interest you in a raspberry? A red, lovely fruit, its slumpy texture is irresistible. <laughs> uh, raspberry, I'm not really interested. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Or... Uh, if you don't help me, I will set your family on fire. <laughs> Use the matchbox. Or uh, matchbox, I'm not really interested. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, hmm. I haven't really tried to analyze this. Or if she was to <laughs> kick the tree trunk, would the fruits <laughs> fall down? Age of tree about 200 to 250 years. Quite old compared to the surrounding trees. Intention unclear. Order cancelled. <laughs> okay. Fair enough, robot lady. Hey, panda. It's a Rudy tree. I guess it kind of is. A hey, the lion is hiding in the water. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what the cork is for. You have to use the cork on his uh, reed or whatever it is that he's breathing through. <laughs> Joking. <laughs> Just cut it out already. Leave me alone. There was a trail of water splotches. <laughs> Lol. Lots of laws. Yeah, this chapter is funnier than the previous ones. It's like the the, the more characters they add to the party, and uh, the the funnier it becomes. Is it just me or are the shadows of the tree starting to appear li like the sun is rising or something? He went over that way again. Well, I would guess it's a, it's the third on the right, since it's the only shaking bit of bush that wasn't shaking before. Yowch! Tingle, Tingle is just a big bully in there. Oh, uh, it's going to be that kind of thing. Uh, the one on the right, I think. You have to pay attention then. Middle one. Yeah, ouch. Well, that wasn't very complicated. Give me a break already. <laughs> I want to do is it's talk to you, get you to join my party, but why won't you? Uh oh, that tree trunk budged. No? Didn't it? I thought it did. It seemed to be moving. No? Or maybe it's just my imagination. Oh, no, stream. Don't die, please. Don't die. Don't die on me. What if I gave him a raspberry? If if, if I could. Some sturdy looking rope you found in the lock cabin. Uh. Oh? A rolling nut. Do I have to try every random bit of bush like this for uh, hidden items or maybe the nut is for um, for the squirrel in that tree trunk maybe to befriend him maybe you can trade it for something else oh it 
doesn't seem to be there anymore. Or was it the other tree? That one, maybe? Hmm. Use the rolling nut. Aren't you happy now? Oh, <laughs> okay. That's all it did. <coughs> he just pooped a bunch of rupees. And Tingle just picked them up. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Which way now? There's only so many... So many places that I could go. <coughs> Behind the frame was a big hole. Okay. I haven't really examined these things. Mm, the first one, I, I think I did. Ah... <sighs> As a certain charm, there are no th signs of life. <laughs> yeah, I've examined this already before. Hmm. Or oh, maybe you can make an offering of the um, the fruit. Don't you offer food to these things normally in Japan? They these are sort of a Statues, I was gonna say. Well, that did something at the very least. What's this? Uh, there are four of them. So I'm guessing I have to make four different offerings to it. So I would have to examine like every little possible bush. To find raspberries ev lying everywhere. That sounds tedious. I know I didn't mean to do that. Come back. This game is so strange. Hey, Mush. Yeah, it is strange. Yeah. Striped nuts. Or should I have given the nut to uh, to the statue before? Yeah, it's a very strange point-and-click adventure. <laughs> mm. Should I try to make another offering to this? Or uh, maybe it's for the squirrel? Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have given that nut to the other squirrel. Because it seems to be blooming all the flowers. Every time I give it something to eat. I'm not sure, maybe it's not a, a compulsory objective. To advance the story, but well. Since you can do it, why not? Why not do it? I'm trying <laughs> everywhere I can. Ah, well, here's another one. I'm only missing one now. Yeah, that one keeps moving every time I, I get there. I, I, I pass through there. And these flowers, there's something about those bees that keep popping up every time I shoot them with my slingshot. Not sure what that's supposed to accomplish. Well, let's try to find one more fruit. But that tree moves every time I... Every time I pass by. Or maybe it's because of the scrolling. Maybe. I am. Maybe it's... 
uh, well, there's another nut. Well, I have enough to give to the statue at least now, so let's see what it does. Just poking around there, because uh, I'm not really sure what I have to do about that lion that keeps running away. I, it's based on... Well, it's loosely based on the Wizard of Oz story. So, uh... Dorothy, or in this case, Tingle, has to be accompanied by the Tin Man, or Tin Woman, in this case, the Scarecrow and the Lion. So... The Lion must join me. Following that logic. What? No? Oh, it won't... It won't eat the same offerings. It has to be four, four different things. Okay, so I have to find yet another thing that it will accept to, to eat. Hmm. Well, I'm discovering as I go. So what kind of game is this? Well, an adventure game, I'm guessing, a point-and-click adventure game where Tingle got uh, sucked into a book that he ordered, which was supposed to, which was an adventure book about the hero that you can see uh, on the right side there, uh, looking very much like Tingle, but for far more butch, <laughs> uh, who just goes on an adventure and who finds love at the end. Because he's 35 years old, he's single, so uh, he doesn't he doesn't have a woman in his life and no job so uh, well he his dream is to find love so uh, that's why he embarked on a uh, on an adventure he's trying to get to a city to a big city maybe I rule town I don't know it's uh, it's it's not exactly explained what city it is and uh, well along the way he meets friends and uh, they 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 all try to reach the city for their own reasons just like Dorothy and uh, the the scarecrow and the lion and the tin man in uh, the wizard of oz i can't remember exactly the story of the wizard of oz i think the tin man wants a heart uh, the lion wants to find his courage and uh what what did the scarecrow want to 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 become intelligent because his head is full of straw <laughs> Li quite literally because he's quite stupid in the, in the original story i don't know i can't quite remember i'm not very familiar with the original story <coughs> yeah like i said on, on the previous stream the only version of the wizard of oz that i only saw on tv was the wiz with the diane ross michael jackson and the like which is more like a uh, a musical more than anything else well I guess the uh, the previous older version uh, in the mo uh, movie version was quite the same as well a large pile of leaves <coughs> pardon me <laughs> that didn't do anything analyze it maybe so yeah, right now what they're trying to do is uh, get to the other side of the bridge that uh, a sort of prince or something just ma made collapse for no apparent reason. So now <laughs> they're stuck in that forest for the time being. They rot and turn into soil. Are they dry enough to burn? Kindling or fire light might be necessary. Hmm. Well, that's as much of a hint as I can get. The leaves are wet and won't burn like this. Okay. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, what can I do to dry the leaves first? Or maybe you just have to wait? <laughs> well, there's the lion, alright. Uh, wait. He has a rabbit thing in his back. He won't hear you because he's wearing earplugs. <laughs> A large person is clinging to the tree. Um, what can I do? <laughs> Try to kick it? Request unclear. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> no? Something soft and fluffy. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Uh, tickle his butt. I can't reach that. Well, let's analyze it. 
he's clinging on with over a hundred force. <laughs> Uh, the, the kind of detail that we absolutely didn't need to know about. Uh, should I read it, the scary story again? He's wearing earplugs. Yeah, of, of course. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. He can't hear me. Hear me. Uh, the oil? No. Uh, well, you have to do something about the the, the leaves. I'm guessing. Set fire to the leaves to get him to, to, to come down. What, what, what? Isn't this place dangerous? Scary, isn't it? Uh, or maybe if I use the oil on the leaves and, and then set fire to it. Yeah, now it would c catch fire, I'm, I'm expecting. Mm. Oh, there we go. Fire produces a stream of smoke. He's getting smoked like a ham. <laughs> cough, cough, oh! <laughs> I got smoke in my eyes. <laughs> Scaredy strong man. Touch the screen. Chapter 3. Uh, so he went this way now. My eyes, my eyes, I can't see. Hey, don't go falling into a hole if you're running blind like this. My eyes, my eyes, I can't see. Well, there we go. <laughs> Help me! Uh, uh, where did that voice come from? My uh, arms! Please help! Oh! Well, I have a rope. I'm guessing that's what it, what it was for. Oh, okay. He's heavy! And the robot, the, the tin woman is just like there, and just, just watching and not helping, as usual. She's as unconcerned as can be. But you just have to keep trying. Uh, shit, 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 shit. Isn't she going to help? <laughs> Do you have an order for me? Yes, help! <laughs> Support for rescue action required, yes! <laughs> Final confirmation, the smartest individual around here, surpassing all others in form and function. Alive or android, who is that? <laughs> yeah, it's you, alright. Your judgment is correct. Let's continue. Something happened to the game capture. Oh shit, ah uh, yeah, yeah, it's my fault. It's my fault. Sorry, just a sec, just a sec, it's my fault. I, I did something I did something to OBS and I didn't mean to. Sorry. It's been dragged across the screen or something. Yeah, that's because I I have that that other window open right behind it because I'm playing this on my PC. I'm emulating it so I can capture it. I should put the window on the on on my other screen. Yeah, that that's it. Because I have two screens. <laughs> that way I don't risk activating it by accident. <laughs> Let's start again from the beginning. Keep it to yourself, I don't care anymore. Big Mister, what's your name? Huh? Lion. Lion is called Lion. What are you doing here, Lion? Uh, I'm very cowardly, so my friends kept making fun of me. How pitiful. I couldn't stand it when they were rude or rough. 
When I got scared, I used to hide in the bell. How clever. B but to live like this... No matter what I try, it never goes well. You can lock the sources so that doesn't happen again. Oh, well, I I'll keep that in mind and I'll try to have a look at it, see if I can do that in the future. Did you hear that, mister? The city? Lion, did you know? You can have your wish come true if you go to the city. With my medal, we can even enter the castle. Huh? So that's it? You're not telling me? You're not going to have an audience with the king? An audience? Yeah. You know, maybe the stories are true. If I meet the king, maybe he'll meet... He'll heal my cardis. For sure, he will, lion. We can all go to the city together. Yeah, what if I lock it then? Uh, like this... Like this. Ah, yeah, and then... Ah, yeah, okay, yeah, and then it doesn't happen again. Okay. Okay, yeah. Ah, that's nice. Lion is our companion, too. Lion is coming with... Companion? No, I'm sorry. I think I should just give up. Ah, that's... That's so sad. That's such... That's such a sad story. I'd just be a burden to you anyway. Lion. <laughs> In the woods, many dangerous life forms I ha are hiding. <laughs> Calculations based on this man's morale level sure probability of survival of <laughs> zero. <laughs> Lion joined Tinkle's party. <laughs> Should I get the muscles? Well, there we have it. I think I have to knock down that tree I saw earlier. Super strength. Yeah, that makes sense. I am much stronger than I look. Besides, I'm really good at talking to animals. Nice to m meet you. Well, maybe I can speak to that squirrel now? Mmm, delicious, it says. Uh, since I can't do anything but that raspberry, maybe he will heat it? Yeah, I'm still missing one fruit for that statue I saw earlier. And now that I think about it, I saw one in the previous chapter, but I didn't know what to do with it. Hmm. Oh? Huh? It's a squirrel. You can't tell this apart from a squirrel. Is that a squirrel? Well, I guess so. Thanks. Thick stem? Well, I don't know what that was for. A thick stem with leaves and branches? Uh. <laughs> sure it's not a scroll? Uh... What's that for? It'll be a squirrel from now on. Squirrel forever. It's a squirrel. It's a squirrel. It's a squirrel. Okay. <laughs> uh, I only found that you could interact with this one completely by accident. Well, let's save. I'll save what I did this far. Because I hadn't saved in a while, so... Better be saved than sorry. Uh... Yeah, there's one screen I haven't really investigated 
this properly. Um, yeah, the one by the pond. Well, let's try to knock down that tree now. Since that guy is with us. Got it, I'll knock over that tree. Yeah, do it, please. Promise that no bugs will drop on me from the tree. Uh, can I promise that? Because I bet that if I promise it, it's going to happen anyway, so... In that case, I'll just stay here. Yeah, okay. I don't have any choice. Ah, okay. Oh, yeah. She, she persuaded him. Power on! I figured it would make a bridge of sorts. <laughs> yeah, but if I leave, if if I leave now, does this mean that I have to leave that thing behind with the statue that I didn't complete? And now it's just him with me. Because I was thinking, I didn't really look everywhere on the screen. There are, like, other bushes. A rolling nut. But I think I already gave it something like that. You really have to try tapping everything. I mean, I could find them with a walkthrough, but it's not the same as finding them on your own. Or did I? Yeah, a raspberry, a rolling nut, a striped nut. I don't know what you want me to do here. Hmm. I'm starting to think that maybe I shouldn't have moved forward so quick because maybe I need the other guys. So I'll reset. I just reload the save file. Since I saved just before. No, I already examined this one. Uh, go back. I already examined this. That one too. A cornfield. Uh. Yeah, there was always a lizard in that one, and I don't know why. Uh. More rupees. Or maybe after I've given three nuts to that, uh, to that squirrel, maybe it'll give me something else that I can then offer the statue. Uh, a squirrel. Easter egg. <laughs> More rupees. Yeah, I keep seeing these bushes. But I don't know... <laughs> so these are the target, don't forget that. Oh, you can interact with them that way too. I don't want to be left behind in these woods. The circle of friends is growing. Yay, yeah, he's always the, the, the happy one of the, of the bunch. The scarecrow. <coughs> uh, that's one I already have. So let's not knock down the trees just just yet. Uh, am 
another raspberry. <laughs> well, I'd like the robot to move from there because it's in the way of that. Oh, okay. Because I was going to say it was in the way of that bush. There's more things that you're supposed to be able to do with the water here. Well, I now have all three types of items that I already gave the statue. Lotus? Are you sure that's what they are? They're, they look more like lily pads to me more than anything else. Okay. Uh, let's shoot these flowers again. I'm still not sure what their what their purpose is. I think I tried that before, but that didn't seem to do anything. Well, maybe I can put water in a bottle. Oh, maybe I can offer water to the sto to, to the statue. for uh, uh, can I water the flowers <laughs> use the water and that didn't do anything I uh, you don't lose it if it doesn't do anything at the very least can't really misuse it. That's a good point. Let's go see that statue again. I should normally have... I think I now have all three types of offerings again, don't I? Yeah, there they are. Hmm. Because I, I don't want to move forward too quick. So I should save again. Since I found a few more things. Just in case I make a mistake so that I can reload. Because I don't know if there are any missables in this game. But if I can, I'd like... Well, not to miss too many things. I mostly want to play for the story, but... Is there something in the bell? No. <laughs> you never know. Uh, I should probably have searched all these bush bushes over there. Damn it, that mouse. I need a mouse mat. <clears throat> okay, let's go back to the statue. What if I ask them to bash one of those trees? To try to make something fall from, from there. Nah, it doesn't want any water. And I suppose if I try to give it something I already gave it... Nah, it doesn't want it. It 
that I tried as well, I think. Yeah, I'm going to try the nut as well, but I, I think it's safe to say that it's not gonna work. Since I already tried that before. It's these small bushes. Like the green one by the steps there. I have no idea what the, what those are for. Uh. Wait, what? That's all they do. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, minus 40 rupees. <laughs> what? <laughs> And now y you can't interact with it. <laughs> it's full of little surprises like this, this game. Yeah, you have to tr you have to be careful not to be too greedy. Yeah, as I can see. <laughs> you can get rupees from them, but you must be careful not to be too greedy. But maybe one of them gives something different. I encountered bushes like this one before too. Uh oh, uh oh. Yeah, okay, okay. I, I got it. Let's not be too greedy. Lion. Super strength. On that tree. But what for? To shake that tree, get those to get those fruits down. I know it's cruel, but I'm running out of ideas there. Or if all else fails, I can still give this uh, nuts and the like to uh, to that squirrel. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. I got it. And then there's this lizard that's in the same bush every time. Okay, let's go there. Yeah, I'm guessing there are <laughs> still other um, places I haven't been to, to to search for these fruits. I haven't really searched that field with the squirrels over there to the right. I haven't really tried much. Well, there's a squirrel. Ah, well, there we go. Okay. Found it. Okay. <clears throat> it's a good thing that there are not more screens to this chapter. this one. I have no idea what it will accomplish. You got new secret. Page 4. The Nutty Monk. Oh, for completion you have to find secrets in each p on each page of the book? Well, uh... That I failed already if I want to complete this <laughs> because I didn't find any on the on the previous pages at least that I can remember I don't remember that page at all that 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 thing that shows the list of secrets uh, okay yeah so you have main objectives on each page of the book but you also have hidden stuff like this that you have to look out for okay I get it. Still looking out for them, just in case. This looks like garbage dump, but there really isn't any smell. Yeah, you have to use your imagination to come up with uh, interactions that are not necessary, but which may yield some secrets. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I'm not going to go for them then. Now that I know that I already can't get 100%, and 
God only knows what that unlocks. I guess I'm never gonna find out. Unless you can replay the chapters after you're done. Like, revisit these locations. Let's unload these. Uh, no, not on the hall. Oh, shit. Well, that's it then. Yeah, let's leave now. Because I, I can't think of any place that I haven't clicked on or uh, any other type of action that I haven't done. Well, I guess the tree. I have not figured out if the tree has any use. But that's okay. I'll knock over that tree. Yes, please. Yes, I'll look at the tree over right away. Lion, power on! We've already been through this. Mister, now we can cross the gorge. Yeah, he's scared of crows, but not much n not much anything else. The scarecrow at the very least. Huh? Cross over there. Cross the gorge, right? N not particularly scary. I'm not worried at all. I just don't feel like it. <laughs> I guess you just cross it yourself. Ah, oh, you're heading off, Mush? Okay. Have a good uh, have a good evening then, my friend. I guess if I... What? Knock down the tree? I guess if I cross, he will be scared to be, be, to be left behind, so... Hey, oi! You won't leave me here alone, right? I don't like heights, you'd understand. Well, oh. <laughs> we move on. Mr. Lion, come on, hurry. What can I do to persuade you? I do shoot him <laughs> but there's an option to knock over the knock down the tree it's already knocked over okay uh, 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 uh. hmm Don't have much ideas. Request. I don't know what you want me to do here. Oh. <laughs> I want you to cross the damn thing. Why should I do that? <laughs> but it still plays the music though. <laughs> it still plays the music even if it's not going to do anything. Well, I guess I could ask for a hint to uh, to to that guy at the safe point. I could ask for it. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, well, a tree likes water, so why not? Wait, wait, wait. No, he doesn't want it. Mm. 
What if you offer him to... To tie him to that tree over there? C can you use the rope on him, to, to just so he won't be scared? Use the rope? What, what do you want? No. The game is not programmed to allow you to, allow you to do that. It didn't take off t take away the rope after I used it for the the only purpose that it had so far in the chapter. So I'm guessing it's used somewhere else using game logic. Uh, and there's this pond. I have no idea what it's for. I still have the screwdriver as well, a flyer full of dubious information. Oh, ah, yeah, 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 I remember what it is. Um. Well, I'm, I'm going to ask for a hint because uh, this page of the book has been going on for quite long enough already as it is. And in like a little or under half an hour, I will have to stop playing as well, so... Please help me, because I don't know what to do. Ultimate understanding, you cosmic spoiler. I found this vehicle just in time to follow you. I will be here if you are ever in trouble. Yes? Yes, please? Are you absolutely sure? <laughs> Very well. Giving hints is my purpose. I can tell you this much. Afraid of high places, I see. You know, when I was a kid, I... And someone showed me a scary book, I'd run for it. Ah, uh, yeah, that makes sense. That's why I was trying to... To shoot him with the with the slingshot earlier. Because I was I thought maybe he will, like... He would get a scare jump and start running in the other direction. But I didn't think of using the scary book for the same purpose. Even though that now that he says so, yeah, it's pretty obvious, naturally. Well, now, if possible at all, I would like to not use these hints anymore. Well, there we have it. Hey! <laughs> Let's hurry and say goodbye to that damn forest. Now that he is across, he's uh, all smug. <laughs> what? Come on, let's go. La la la. That's the end of the page, I guess. Uh, there we go. Page cleared. <laughs> yes, it is. A... 1,800, 8,800, welcome to the stream. Ah, uh, should I, I clicked too quick. I forgot to read the text. Look, mister, is that the train station over there? Bro, you won? I'm sorry, I don't get ya. Can we ride the train? Is that an ostrich over there? I don't like riding in vehicles. W is there anything that guy likes? They always shake, I get sick quickly. <laughs> Actually, he reminds me of someone I know. <laughs> Walking to the sea would take forever. Alright, Tingle, let's ride the, stream the steam train. Chapter 1, The Yellow Rails. Well, I might do that chapter. Still, I can save. Alrighty. Uh, no, 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 don't save again. There's no use for that. Okay. That looks like an ostrich. There's a bird in the distance. Oh, it's coming over here. Ah, there's the... 
map selling guy. I've picked this up. Picked up the station map. 50 rupees. Bat leaving the woods. And the ost ostrich is gone. Oh, the lion doesn't like insects. Is he going to be scared? What? There's nothing under the rock. Ah, no. The E didn't react at all. Uh, oh, what's in there? Ominous looking eyes. A squirrel? I don't have anything anymore for him, right? No? Oh, well. Uh, okay, let's go then. To the station it is. Hey, look! The yellow road turned into a yellow railway track. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 a fair point. Yeah, amazing. As well, it seems pretty run down. What's that over there? Hey, wait. They all left me. A sign in the shape of an arrow. It seems locked, so uh, it's locked. There's a keyhole, so I'm guessing I need a key, a rust covered gate secured by a sturdy lock. Yeah, okay. Staff room. There's the same kind of statue. It's a rock or something. You can't really tell because it's so dirty. Uh, I'm gonna need water first, I'm guessing. Or maybe you don't necessarily have to bring it like several types of offerings like in the previous chapter. Because I think I did something to a statue like this in the first... Uh, in the first or a second... No, I, I, I always say chapters. But no, it's more like pages. Some building material... Is that a clock? The battery is dangling from the clock. You can't reach the battery, no matter how you stretch. <laughs> the broken clock is dangling from the ceiling. It's, it no longer works. The hands are twitching. Maybe the robot is going to... Like drop a battery or something and you and you're gonna have to pick that one as a replacement an old photo people are shaking hands in front of the station oh something hidden there's something there take it conductor badge well I guess that game came out on the Nintendo DS around the same time that Zelda Spirit Tracks did. So maybe there are some references in there? A yellow flag is fluttering far in the distance. There could be some references to it, like maybe the music is going to be used or something? Far away station. No doubt about it. They had variable form eco trains here. But how to get inside? Ah. S sorry. <laughs> what? Is falling in love? With the lady? I Molester spotted! <laughs> All females flee at once! <laughs> Pointing and calling, string strictly enforced. Uh, 
examine, take. It's a gutter, it smells a little bit. Can you pull it up? Oh. That requires super strength, I guess. From the lion. An empty wash ball. Filled with ordinary water. Maybe I can clean up that statue I found earlier that way. More bugs. And there was nothing else in under it. Okay. Examine. Rusty shutters that haven't been used in a long time. Well, obviously you can't open it. Maybe with the super strength of the lion. It hops around in an unhelpful manner. be a sign. Entry for trained personnel only. But I do have a badge, so I guess I could pass for uh, <laughs> for trained personnel, in some sense. Yeah. Let's see. How about we gave that statue a little wash? You remove the dirt. Maybe it's gonna be happy that way. <laughs> that was random. The Muddy Monk. Well, I found a new secret. I stumble upon them every now and then. Oh, it's still in Japanese on the on the thing. Uh, well, I still don't have what it takes to open this, so let's move along. Hey, Tingle. The girl who just dashed away full speed. Do you think she's an employee here? Oh no, it's getting worse. What? Look, all that junk. It's completely blocking the tracks. No trains can pass. This station is useless to us. <laughs> Incomplete information. We have to investigate the surroundings first, <laughs> to see if there is a vehicle for us or not. Yeah. Yeah, without a train, those tracks are not much use indeed. We'll have to remove this trash at some point. Hey, there's a red bird up there. The one from before was yellow. A pansy? What are all these rocks for? There is nothing in, uh, under them except for bugs every time, and they just run away. This track has been abandoned. Thank you for being our longtime passengers. Far away station master all, all aboard. Climb. Gracefully resting its wings. Well, it goes to the green when I examine it, but that's that's about all it does. Uh, I can't examine anything else. It's an old watchtower. Okay, I'll descend. Don't know what else I can do. Except maybe bring my partners with me. Yeah, they're going to follow me now. Uh, let's go behind it. Use that super strength of him, of his. Or maybe analyze it first. <laughs> Me 
metal shutters. Opening them takes a lot of power because of weight and deterioration. Yeah, but the lion is super strong. So? Bugs. Spiders. Ghosts. What is it? There's a person's hand here. Uh, if it's a corpse, yeah, that would be a bit scary. But this being a... Uh, a game for a young audience, I'm not expecting it to be the case. Nah, it's gloves. In the crack you spy a pair of gloves. It might be useful. Take it with you? Yeah, for sure. I gotta find the lion again now. Uh, where, is, where did he go? Where did he run off to? Just trying to get the screen to scroll now. Is he in the tree? No. I'm guessing not. Nope. Let's go back. of lumber. You don't notice anything unusual. Or did he go up the tower? Uh, oh, he's over there in the field. Uh, use the slingshot. No. Scary. Oh, he's scared of a pair of gloves. In the distance, lion squats, shivering. Ow, oh, that. Ow, oh, that. That hurt. Mm. What then? You want a nice flower? Scary. Hey, everything is scary to him. Analyzes. <laughs> Lion spot in the distance. <laughs> Noticing temporary withdrawal <laughs> behavior. <laughs> Recommendation physical therapy. For example, a kick to the buttocks. Well, go, go out there and kick him in the butt then. Which I'm sure she won't have any problem doing. <laughs> it's a cruel game. <laughs> when you think about it. It's a really cruel game. Uh, I just want to go down. Let, let me go down. Let me go down! Okay, yeah, this, this, this end. Come on, lad. Don't be so scared all the time. Examine. He still seems kind of frightened. Come on. A human hand in the sh sh shutter. It's gloves, you dummy. Use the rubber gloves. W what are you doing? How could you take the gloves off a dead person? Gloves? What are you looking at me like that for? Come on, let's open those shutters. <laughs> He's always going to deny being scared. I can't remember. Maybe it was like that in the Wizard of Oz story. Uh, lion. Super strength. Are you okay now? <laughs> well, 
There's our transport. Hey, kitty. Wow, a train. A steam train, to be precise. A steam train. Got it. Whatever, let's try to get it going. There's a lamp. It doesn't work because the battery is missing. Well, that's where my battery is going to go then, I guess. Hey, there's um, a, a train conductor's hat there. There's a dirty locker. Open it! You opened the locker. It seems empty to me. It's too dark to tell if there's anything inside. Oh, come on. A worn out hat might be useful to get with you. Conductor hat. Junk is piling up. Four passengers detected. Please turn on the master controller. What was that, Bariki? Did you say something? <laughs> it wasn't me. Alright, yeah, it's, it's the same kind of robotic voice, I guess. It said something about a master controller. Something is glittering inside. Take it. Station key. Ah, that might go into the padlock that I saw earlier. I need a valve handle, I guess. Something like that. Is the lion scared that it does this little thing on the icon, or... Oh well. Uh, g -g 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 examine. A square axis is jetting out of the base. But mm. you can't turn it with bare hands. Yeah, it won't yield. Uh, or maybe that's what the gloves are for. Use the rubber gloves. Ah, oh, that didn't do anything either. Uh, a groove that looks like an arrow. A small plate is engraved with writing. Master controller. Okay. Ow. Hey, kitty. Oh. Orbital Industries. Ah, oh. uh, but I still have the screwdriver on me normally. It's a pretty silent game. <laughs> there is some sort of mechanism inside. There are letters. It's too dark to read them, though. Ah! I guess that's why I need the lamp to be functioning. Analyzes. Due to insufficient lightning. Well, at least they thought about it. Okay, well, I need a battery. I think that's the last thing I, I'll be doing for tonight. Before I had to have to head out. Uh, pointing and calling street reinforced. Oh, yeah, I saw that before. Uh, go that way. Can one of them reach it? None of them can, apparently. You can't reach a battery no matter how you stretch. Uh, make it fall, then. Force it to drop down. There we go. Thought so. over there let's hope it's not out of juice though well now that I have a lamp I'm gonna be able to examine the locker and that thing in the locomotive but that's going to be for a future stream though because I have to stop playing now. I only had two hours for tonight. 
Okay. Good day. I am pig. Let's save. What is it, kitty? Uh, that's it for tonight, then. Thank you for watching, lurking, commenting, taking part in the chat, or whatever. Uh, we'll see you guys pretty soon. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, maybe tomorrow night? I'm not sure 100%, but we'll see. Normally, it should be tomorrow night. Okay, see you guys. Bye-bye. Have a good night, evening, or afternoon, depending on where you are.